Well, this voyage for the Sir Peter Blake Trust is off to the Kermadex. And the Kermadex are situated deep in the Pacific, and so we're particularly proud and privileged to be able to take young New Zealanders, and we're deeply interested in stewarding and protecting the sea. Here we have this group of young, very passionate New Zealanders who've got the opportunity to go off on this expedition with the Royal New Zealand Navy and be with real scientists and come back and inspire their peers and every one of them has the ability to make a difference. We are exploring New Zealand's largest marine reserve by protecting significant areas of the marine environment like this. We can see things get better and those things are so important as places of hope and inspiration for this younger generation as they move into a really challenging future with regard to the environmental health of the planet that we all share. It is amazing being able to experience a pristine environment like the Kermadex. We don't get these opportunities very much back home. You get the odd pockets of conservation, so um, I'm very privileged to have been given this opportunity and thankful. Who would ever imagine that me at 15 would be going to this place which not many people get to go to and look at the biodiversity and everything so it really is a magnificent gift and treasure and I feel really privileged to be here. When a scientist comes to you and says in a few days you're going to be swimming with sharks, you're going to be swimming with fish that you very rarely see in New Zealand, you just don't believe them. Um, and then when I was out the other day you're snorkelling with, with the fish and you're snorkelling, you've got sharks swimming next to you, you've got massive turtles swimming under you and it's just, it's hard to comprehend. We've been doing heaps of really cool science. We have been observing seabirds. There are just hundreds of them over in Macaulay Island and the islands by Rao Island. My personal highlight probably was one of the boats went out and we collected some algae from the reefs here at the Kermadex. And we came across a certain little green algae that there are very few samples for. And our algae specialist, Wendy here on, on board the ship, got so excited she was dancing around the room to have samples of this. And I think that just reminds you how cool and how exciting real discovery can be. I get very excited when the scientists get excited. So um, the other day we found out that a species of black trevally were found at the Kermadex and they'd never been seen there before. I've actually been really impressed with the engagement of the students. I think the students have really latched onto the opportunity to work with scientists and um, I'm hoping that it has inspired some of them to continue in this field or to at least continue in their concern for the environment because I think seeing a place like this when they go back home and compare it to what they see at home, they'll always have this as a memory of what it could be like with good management. So these young people are now citizens of the planet as opposed to people who are just members of their own localised community. So having them engage in this way and see in a very real sense that this ocean connects us all, no matter what island, no matter what nation we live on, is an important part of just broadening their horizons and understanding so that they can become leaders for a better future. We tend to protect what we love. So if we enjoy all these wonderful natural places that sometimes it's really easy to take for granted in a coastline-centric place like New Zealand, the more we want to love them, the more we want to look after them. So I really would love to see people taking hold of all those natural places in their community and, and wanting to, to respect and look after them like we're doing here. Really to me, meeting all the young people, meeting all the scientists and leaders on this trip in the Navy, was sort of the big part. They're not just friends for this Young Blake expedition, they're friends for life and they're the connections I'm going to keep as I go into my career. Yelp and this have changed the way I view the world definitely for the better. It's exposed me to inspirational people and really challenged me as a person and made me grow as a leader. The biggest thing I've learned on this expedition is that you're never too young to taste a passion and change the world.